After growing up in Mundelin, Illinois, Eddie Barrañón was deported to Mexico City last year. The 21-year-old can't remember life in Mexico. When he landed in the nation's capital, he knew no one. It was kind of scary at the beginning. My whole family is over there in the States, so I felt lonely and lost. People don't see as me as real Mexican, you know? I was raised in, uh, in the United States, and I have the American culture come back to Mexico. And he starts saying, oh, they think they're American, they then should go back. Why are they even back here? Eddie was one of over 13,000 non-criminal deportations from the U.S. in 2017, many of them young immigrants protected by the Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals Act, or DACA. They now find themselves alone in Mexico City. Adjusting to their new life in Mexico can be overwhelming for returning migrants. And although they will have had no say in being taken away to the United States as children, back here in their original country, they face discrimination on a daily basis. Yet one Mexican organization is seeking to give these individuals a helping hand. You know, why are you trying to... Founded last year, Ola Code is teaching essential programming skills to 22 U.S. deportees to help them find work. So the current trends of migration around the world is they're more about being a little bit more closed, uh, not open to other nations. But I see migration as a positive thing. And that is sort of what we want to reflect and show through Ola Code, that migration is something very positive that we can benefit from, we can create from, we can innovate from. And the exchange of cultures and perspectives can have a, a really good result into a country, a society, and economies. The intensive five-month course will equip these individuals with skills in hot demand, not only in Mexico, but across the world. For Eddie, it's a chance at a fresh start with better opportunities than he says he would have had as an illegal immigrant in the US. Now that I'm back here in Mexico and actually being someone and having a career, it's awesome. It's something that I never thought I would have because of the chances I didn't have over there in the United States. As Ola Code grows, its alumni will finance it as they move into full-time employment, repaying the $7,000 that the company charges them to learn this life-changing skill. It's an operation, the founders say, that is both a solid business and a social responsibility. Alistair Baverstock, CGTN, Mexico City.